So what if I would like to see the share of each month on the total revenue for the year? So how much share does January revenue, how does it compare to the total revenue in the year? What am I going to need? I'm going to need two figures. I will need the revenue for January and then I'm going to have to divide it by the total revenue for the year. So basically, I'm going to have to say each of these months, I will have to divide their revenue by the total revenue for that year. And remember, everything has to go by filters context. So I'm going to need to do something to get this revenue for the whole year so I can divide each month by that revenue. I need to ignore the filter context completely. Or I need to ignore certain filter context completely. So I'm going to ignore filter context. I need to look for a function that can do that for me. Just like we looked for calculate. Calculate is a super function that I can use to alter the filter context. But then I need to ignore the filter context on the month level. So I can do the percentage of each month's revenue on the total revenue for the year. Okay, so I'm going to leave the year's revenue fine, but I'll have to ignore the filter context on the month. So I'm going to have to introduce a function called all, which I will use in conjunction with calculate. Okay, so let's go define a new measure. So this is going to be called all year, or let me say uh, yearly revenue. So yearly revenue is going to be equals to calculate. What am I calculating? I want to calculate revenue, comma. Now for the filter, I don't want any filter on the month level. So I'm going to say calculate revenue, but show me everything that is all. Show me everything on what. So all is asking me to put in a table name or a column name. So show me everything on the month. But because month is sorted alongside month number, I will have to bring up month number as well. So show me everything on month and month number. So when I close bracket twice and hit enter, so let's see how that looks like. So my yearly revenue is going to be equal to this. So as you can see, for everything, all the months on 2014 is returning the total figures for 2014. All the months on 2015 is returning the total figures for 2015.